What's going on everyone? <laughs> Today we're in Burleson, Texas at Palm Harbor Homes. We're getting ready to check out another Fleetwood single wide. This one is model 16562 Alpha. It is a two bedroom, two bath, and it is, sits inside of approximately 868 square feet. We've been getting into them today. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. The skies are blue, the sun is out. We're getting after it. We, uh, there's like 14 or so homes here uh, that we're touring. Every now and again, I'll come across one that wasn't on the list, but you know, I poked my head in it. Anyway, uh, in terms of the price for this home, it is currently, oh, this is like one of the more affordable ones that we've seen today. We've seen some nice single wides too. Uh, but this one is approximately $70,000. I know we're getting up towards the road. This Palm Harbor is right off of I-20, which takes you back to my beautiful home state of South Carolina. So love that. I like that I could hop on the road right now and just go straight on home, you know what I mean? Anyway, uh, as we work our way back up to the front door, and before we get inside, if you would like any more information on this model or any of the models that we've toured across the country, you can use the Find My Floor Plan Finder on our website at timothyplivingston.com to filter homes based on your specific needs. It's all 100% free, so definitely go check that out. You can find the link for that down in the description. And here we go. So. When you first walk in, this is the view that you're agreed with. You got the living room and the kitchen area right here. I'll go ahead and turn you around so you can check out the front door. And actually, let's go ahead and to the right hand side as soon as you walk in. This actually takes you down to the secondary uh, bedroom or the smaller bedroom. You've got the furnace right here and into the first full bathroom. So you got a single vanity. I wasn't sure if I was gonna have to, this one doesn't have electricity, but that window right there provides tons of light. So I don't really have to break out the flashlight at all, but nice shower and tub combo. And then at the end of the home, this spans the width. Well, kind of actually, I take that back because you got the closet right there. It's a little different, not quite the length or the width of the home, but Still a good sized room. You got this great big window right here. And then into its closet. Now we have been, <laughs> there's some, I actually just came out of a triple wide and uh, it was by Palm Harbor. This one, I don't know if I mentioned that or not. Is, did I mention that? This one, uh, this is a Fleetwood home. I'm sure I did. Maybe I didn't, I'm not sure. Anyway, um, but that triple wide, whoo. That thing was serious. But I love the exposed, they got the exposed beams kind of running throughout the entire main living area. I like that. And then these Fleetwood homes, they've all been, I'll show you this real quick because we're right next to it. They've got these like wooden valances up above the windows. I think that looks super sharp, kind of rustic looking. But then from there you come into the kitchen, just a wide open kitchen. For me personally, I probably need an island just to kind of break it up a little bit, kind of help divide the kitchen from the living room, I think. That's just me though. Plus it'd give you a little bit of extra counter space too. Then you've got these quick adjust shelves, which is super nice. Got the dishwasher sink looking out this window right here. And then let's get into some of these cabinets. Ooh, that goes way back there. I think all of these, these two are attached. And you've got plenty more uppers. So a lot of cabinets in here. You got the stove, the refrigerator, a little open cabinet up above that. And then a little spot for a table. Or you could even do that too, like have an island that uh, kind of doubles as a table, you know what I mean? So where you have like a little lip, some benches. So you got access out on to the back side of the home right next to us. And then you've got your washer dryer hookups. A nice little shelf up above that and then all the way at the end of this hall you come into the master bedroom so this one actually does span the the width of the home
get over here in this corner so you can get a, this angle. It's got a clean size bed in here, nice big dresser, little chair. Ooh, nice little soaking tub too. And then uh, into the ensuite, you got double vanity. Got some recessed vanity lights. And then huge corner garden tub. Got the standalone shower. The toilet. And what do we got here? Ooh, that's a cool way to do it. And you got that corner closet. I mean, I feel like you could, using it like that, sitting it up towards the front of the room. What's over on this side? I mean, you could have put the doorway right there too, I think. Anyway, let me know what you think about this helmet down in the comments. If you do want any more information on uh, this model, you can find that link right there at the top of the description. Or you can go over to timothyplivingston.com where you can search not only this floor plan, but all the floor plans that we've toured across the country. And you can see if they're built in your area. You can filter them down by state. So all the homes that we've ever toured, uh, if they are available in your state, they'll populate, even if we didn't tour them in that state. So just know that if, you're, if you are over there. You can also filter by price, square footage, number of bedrooms, all that fun stuff. And it's all 100% free, so you can go over there and play all day long. Anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for touring this home with me. I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, my name is Timothy. I'll see your beautiful face in the next one.